welcome back everybody so this will be the second to last episode of um, the series uh, I'm gonna do two episodes for this weekend and then I'm gonna switch over to Osmium um, I'm gonna run a short campaign before they get the vehicle um, update implemented um, and then we'll switch again to a new campaign with the vehicle update and we'll continue on with what I've got planned uh, my storyline so with that being said, let's have a quick look at the mech bay because I did make one change to one of the mechs, the Kentaro. Now, uh, Fissador mentioned, why don't I put a, an additional large heavy laser in this side to keep the heat up? Uh, I didn't have one, but I did have a um, LPPC plus TL cap. So uh, that's not bad. So I pulled out all the SRMs plus the medium pulse, which equaled five tons in total. Drop this in, so that'll give us 100 heat plus our movement. Uh, plus the tagger, which is six, I think, four. And the fire fist, which I think can fire at short range for 15 heat. So that should jack our heat up uh, for each move that we're not close to the enemy to get our TSMs up. So I'm hoping that works out a little better uh, in this particular mission um, that we got going on today. And the other thing I did, because since we're going to be finishing up, I sold off all of our mech parts and storage to get a ton of C-bills. We only made about four million in total which wasn't a lot, but I did spend some because I went ahead to the engineering section, increased our drop size. So um, we've got the Junkyard Leopard now with an additional one drop size, which which means we can command one more uh, mech warrior because I got the command console as well. So we'll have five mechs to play with instead of four, which is pretty good, I think, overall. And if we go to the command center, I think I want to try, I think, is it the general? Which one was it here? Uh, yeah, here we go. Uh, Brilliant Minds. It's a recovery mission. Three Skull. We'll be up against some good co good competition. Uh, it's good salvage rate. Um, and it's not against the clan. It's uh, Oximation forces. So we're going to go ahead and go after these guys. I'm going to negotiate, go full salvage, accept. And now we just got to figure out what we're going to run here. I think we want to go bring you down um, do I want to go with the I don't think I want to go with the treb I really don't it's not bad for mobility and it is well it is a rescue operation so we could jump in and jump out and grab the person but I think I want to go with something with a little more firepower and that's going to be the urban mech with the rotary auto cannon and the large improved heavy laser so let's go with that. Uh, we'll leave the adder out. We don't need the flames, I don't think, for this particular one. I'm not looking to capture anything. Um, so yeah, I think we're pretty good here. So let's get to business here. All right, here we go. Five on the ground. Looks like we've got an additional three with us. And that's where we got to go to. So probably two lances to fight through. All right, what do we got with us here? Oh, we got a full lance with us. So we got nine guys then. So we got a drill sin, trebuchet, hornet, hunter. So LRM 20, follow the leader ammo. That guy doesn't have much. The Trebs Parabell around 15s and a narc launcher and this guy's got a Lerm 10 and a large laser we gotta watch out for. Okay. So we're gonna push it up. Let's just do a little bit of recon here. I think we'll just move and brace on turn one. I don't know where everybody is up there. Moving to position. Thank you, GV. Um We got a pretty good jump on this guy. I completely forgot about that. Roger. I'm gonna jump over here. Probably shouldn't have, but actually we're just gonna brace on turn one. We're not gonna get the heat up. We're standing in water. It's just gonna vent most of it anyway. So we might as well stay braced. I guess I should have just ran, but whatever. Whatever. All right. Yeah, you don't have any speed at all. Full we never did get the core upgraded on this thing, but whatever. 
Still has pretty heavy firepower. That's all I care. <laughs> I think the urban mech's about just as fast as that thing is. Thanks, man. Get up there. Okay, this is going to be full sprint now. See if we can get out of the water. Alright, we got a Clint, 40 tonners, full armor. Just going to drop some regular lerms on this guy. Wake up, buddy. We're here. Bring it on in. we get eyes on this guy? No? Alright, just keep pushing forward. Hopefully we can get on that hill next turn. Waiting for orders. Same with you. Almost out of the water. On the way. Double time. Let's get this thing on overload before I forget. Beautiful. Everybody's in the red so far. You can jump farther than that. Just barely, eh? Just a little bit farther, but we're going to spread it so we're not unstable. And then we'll go ahead and target the ground here. Uh, yep. Wow, yeah, we're standing in water too, right? It's just pretty much of a waste of time. Should have jumped then. Uh, yep, right to there. Let's just use the standard lerms on this guy. 0.9, huh? Well, we'll give up on it. No point wasting it. Just like that guy is doing. Well, you know, the Lur LRM5, if he's got like a full ton of ammo, he's going to be shooting forever. It's almost a waste to have a full ton of ammo with an LRM5. Half ton still gives you 12 turns of shooting. Okay. Somebody with an LRM-5 back there. What's this guy? Shadowhawk? Grasshopper. Okay. Well, we are at three skulls, so... Yeah, thanks for being a part of the team. All right. Um, how far forward do I want to go here? Let's just crest the hill. I don't know what else they've got here. Bulldog. All right, we're going to target this guy. I'm going to leave the rockets off for now. Uh, let's leave the tag off. Um, it's actually multi then. Let's shoot U and U and B can take the tag arrow. Primitive. The only reason why I'm doing it is because we can splash damage. Yeah, see? A little bit of splash. Ah, glad you joined the fight. I thought you are actually doing anything. All right, girl, let's uh, get into the trees. Let's get some SRM dead fire on this guy. Switching over to SRMs and our dead fire ammo, 40%. That's not bad. Taking it. Oh, this guy's taking a head hit already? I guess so. Okay, I'm on it. Okay, not bad. Oh, he's primitive engine. So I'm really interested in installing Osmium. I got the most recent version downloaded. It's 1.6 and there was an update. So that just happened, I think, yesterday, the day before or something like that. I got that downloaded. Hey there. Let's get into here. That'll put us right on top of this guy almost. Um, 
Oh, let's just shoot at him. Firing at all. All right. Yeah, I don't know what's better. I mean, I've only got two uh, energy hard points on the Kintaro. So I don't know whether it's better to have... Like, I, I had four more heat with the... Um, with the... Uh, uh, medium pulse laser. And the three SRMs. But I couldn't... I mean, I can't just fire the SRMs all the time at the ground and increase my heat. So, I don't know. Without another, I mean, we do have a PPC, but then I gotta strip something else off. It's another ton more, so I don't know. I mean, I guess I could pull off the uh, jump jets. We don't get a chance to use death from above all that often, so I don't know. We might get a chance to use it. Get as many as you can, buddy. 48, eh? That's a carrier. Alright, well. You gotta hope you can get back there and see that carrier, man. Where are you here? Get over here. Um... Gonna leave the barrage off. I want to use it on the vehicle, so let's just fire on this guy. Yeah, the big one missed. So the uh, the same guy that's working on the um, the vehicle mod and the lance mods is also working on a uh, a mod for altering your fire, um, which weapons fire first. So there's like little arrows here, up or down. So you can move which level we, uh, weapons fire first or second and stuff. It's kind of it's really cool looking. Okay, that puts me in in ability to shoot a vehicle here, and gives me some nice protection. Can we get this guy? Not man, nah, not very well. This guy's even worse. Twenty eight. That's a little better. Let's just go to four like we were doing before. And open up on this guy. Nothing. Nothing. Yeah, uh, your TSMs are not on yet. So, um, let's get into here. Go through the fire, didn't we? Did we? I thought we went through the fire. That's good chances on this guy. Eh. Okay, you it is. You it is. Let's just do this. Do I want to overheat this turn? Yeah, because we're going to be running in the water. I want as much heat as possible. Wow. That bad, huh? Well, thanks for showing up, buddy. Oof. Just gonna stay there, eh? Okay, let's get into here. And let's go ahead. Yeah, let's just finish this guy up. What's he got left in the center? Not much. Um, Seventeen percent, eh? All right, let's just hit this guy. See ya. See ya. Can I get a witness?
Just move it up. Better chance to hit that way. Gonna go through one of the vehicles, I think. This guy's what? That's a pretty good chance to hit. Mm, let's work on this grasshopper. Okay, three hits. Not bad. Some good instability. Still got... Uh, who do we got left? Arclight and our Farazon. I might use my... Uh, I don't know. That carrier is pretty deadly. I was going to say I might use my rocket packs on that, uh, that guy over there, but... Nice. At least the AMS is doing its work here. It actually managed to stay spread out pretty well this time. Not that it makes that much difference, but still. It's good practice. Yeah, you're going to regret that, buddy. I'm coming for you. I'm a coming for you. Let's walk over here. Uh, are we going to be above the uh, urban? Yeah, we're shooting over his head. Beautiful. Just fire on this guy. Uh, regular SRMs. Let's just go with this route. And yep. All right, one hit. A couple of missiles, not bad. Stripping that armor. Their carrier still has to go. Hopefully it'll fire on one of their one of our uh, escorting vehicles here. Unlikely, but you never know. We might get lucky. Here it comes. Good, he's moving up. Ah, uh, he shot in the right person. I mean, we still took a bunch of damage, but uh, that's the max AMS. It's the only other mech with AMS. Okay, keep working on that grasshopper. Okay, buddy. All right, let's just get up into here. Forty-three, huh? Um, gonna warlord it in this guy. Firing. Is that enough? That was enough. Beautiful. Enemy unit destroyed. Okay, so the main threat's pretty much gone now. So far, the Kantara hasn't been able to do its job yet. I don't think this is the right mission for it, although TSMs are on, we still can't move that far. Let's, um... Let's move to here. So we can stay out of the water. That way next turn we can cross the water. And, um... Let's just go this route. Okay, tags on. Beautiful. Yep. All right, Arclight, follow that up with some good hits if you can. Uh, this guy's up. Lerms are 40, so let's take it. And here it comes. Here we go. Looks like we penned. Beautiful. Let's get right into the water. That'll save our ass here. Nice. Keeps us under heat. Okay, who's going here? Grasshopper? Yeah, trying to figure out what the hell he's doing, I guess. We've also got a guy here. Oh, you just stood there. What can I do for you? 
Okay, let's get over here. Get our stability back and we'll open up on this guy again. And here it comes. Beautiful, the big one hit. Nice. Guy's stressing out now. Walk it forward. Same thing, let's just target this guy. And... Yep. Okay, the big one hit, nice. How can you don't stress when I shoot you? Alright, GV, get up in here. Target this guy. I'm going to use the rocket pack on him. See if we can clock him out. Here it comes. Okay, a lot of nice hits, but not enough to kill. Panicking. Beautiful. Can you death from above a vehicle? Suppose we'll find out soon enough. I should jump over there and see if I can step on the thing. Like two jumps, one over here, shoot this guy, and then jump on this guy. Or run and step on him, we'll see. Nice. Yeah, at least they're trying. Okay, Dust Raker. Let's get across the water. And yes. Leave the fire fists off. The TSMs are still on. That should give us that we're now we're in range of the vehicle. Unless it runs. Ha, send me a real opponent. Yeah, don't tempt fate. That's when they drop an atlas on your ass. Yeah. Um Okay, let's get into here. And if we switch to CIRMS... Let's go to Deadfire. Yeah. Shred him! There you go. Torso gone. Come on, make him bail out. Make him bail out. I wait your command. Try and keep our guys under uh, AMS here. Let's move up to here. We're going to give that vehicle to Dust Raker, so we're just going to shoot this guy. Here it comes. Oh, nice hits. Have a seat, buddy. Well, that's it for you. See if we can shoot his head off. Come on, buddy. You don't have many or many places to go. You don't have very many places to go. I wonder if this is going to be it, though. Usually when you pick the scientist up, there's a, another lance that shows up between you and your escape point, but... I don't know. We'll find out soon enough, I guess. Guy's panicking. He's panicking. I guess I better sprint over here. Let's target this guy. See if we can take his head off. Firing. Whoops. Enemy mech destroyed. 
Wait, that said pilot. Oh, we did take his head off. <laughs> oh my God! I, I just I never thought that was going to happen. Honestly, I didn't. All right, let's see if you can uh, shoot this guy instead of Dust Raker here. All right, one hit, no big deal. Now you shot somebody in the back. When does uh, Dust Okay, Dust Raker goes on 20. Move GV up. Let Dust Raker squash that thing. There you go, buddy. It's all yours. Finally get to use those TSMs. There you go, 271 damage. I'll take it. Down. You got that right. Gonna put you right here. Confirmed. We're just gonna brace and cool off. What can I do for you? Sprint into the water, because we can't go any further. I'm wondering if we're going to have uh, another Lance here. Yeah. Can you get in there? You can. Perfect. Okay, you stay right there. Waiting for orders. We need to heat you up. I'm going to jump you to fire. Then we're going to shoot the ground, like right here. Maybe that's a little much. That's probably a little better. Something like that. All right, let's do this. Just in case we get a, uh, just in case we get uh, more guys. I'm receiving you. Okay, let's move into here. Brace. I don't know if we're going to get anybody else. Alright, there we go. Come on, decide what you're doing. That's it, eh? Three skulls? Well, that was le legitimately disappointing. 31,000 which I'm sure we took that in damages. Let's grab the three grasshopper parts. We can just sell them. Maybe make our financial report. And then uh, 280 core. Be nice if there's a little toggle button here that just said choose most expensive components. Swarm, Thunder. Let's just go this way. Yeah, beautiful. So it's a whole lot of whatever. Okay, let's have a look here. Yeah, 30,000. Six days for repair. Now, how close to financial report are we? Are, are we? We've got enough C-bills for the financial... Well, we don't have enough C-bills for the financial report. How far away are we? Nine days. we got enough time. I wrapped up that job you asked for. Beautiful. There we are. Let's just check the mech base and make sure we got everybody in store. Okay, we're going to go ahead... Um, Go to the command center. Let's take one more mission today. Uh, let's try... Is it the insurgent leader? Which one is... This one's Oxamite province as well. Let's go against these guys. Three skull. Now, which one is this? That's Torians. Hanseatic League. Hmm... Try to figure out which ones to save for the uh, last episode. This one's probably the good one. Two and a half skull, but it's against um, Hell's Horses and it's an assassinate, so most likely it's going to be up to 15 mechs, maybe? So let's grab Raiding Party right now. We're going to go ahead and go do this one. And we'll go with the same Lance, I think. I think it suited us well last time. Hopefully the Kentaro can get some more action. If it doesn't, 
I'll pull, I don't know. Maybe I'll pull it out. I don't know. We'll see. All right, let's see what these Taurians are up to. Okay, so we got one Lance over here. Uh, what do we got? Looks like a Hunchback or a Linebacker, or maybe? I don't know. And three vehicles. Centurion, maybe? Yen Lo Wang? I don't know. And then I'm sure we'll have a Lance up here on the right. All right, Raker. Let's get heated up fast. Let's get heated up fast. And yep. Copy that. TSM's on. TSM's off. Wow, we drained all of that heat. We drained, I don't know how we drained all the heat. Roger. Don't know how we drained all that heat, but whatever. What's ever. Will, be done. will it? All, in all right, uh, let's get this turned on. Right, overload. Done. How far can you go? That's fine. Got to get you in the line of sight as fast as we can. Being in the water, they should be able to spot me now. Heads up, Commander. You've got hostile contacts inbound. Well, at least they're moving in quickly to die. I should just send off... Uh, I should send the Kentaro off to the right here with the uh, Urban Mac just to shred everybody up on that hill. I mean, we could. We could split up. Make it interesting. I have no idea what they got coming in on the hill. Hmm. Well, let's get into here first. Got an unknown on Chameleon. Okay. Rotunda, Gladius Mark II, Light AC-5, that guy's got to die, all those rocket packs. That guy's just got a large laser. It's a lot of ballistic. Hmm. It's going to heat me up a lot. Let's just leave one of these off. All right. Well. Okay, what else do we got up here? Ostrock, okay. Larger medium lasers, I think. I think maybe I'll just send this guy this way to finish off everybody over here. Yeah, I gotta leave that on. All right. This heat is cooking my internal structure. Yeah, you'll be squatching next turn anyway. Another chameleon. Hard to tell. They seem it's a Yen Lo Wang. They seem to blend into the terrain. That's an AC twenty. We gotta get on that guy right away. Yeah, it's an AC twenty. I'm ready. Um Get right on this guy. We're going to fire everything, including the rockets. 
See if we can get him unstable. Ooh, head hit. I'm out of LRM. Head hit. All right, well. I was hoping we'd have some resolve so that we could, uh, so that we could uh, get some initiative. Warhammer. Man, I'm getting some classic mechs in here now. I hear you. Should we fire them maneuver? 31% chance. I think we need to move in fast. Can we get the Yenlo Wang? We can from here. I think he's he's uh, target number one right now. We're going to wind it up and fire on this guy. 18%, but we'll take it. No hits, huh? I think we hit that rock. Seventeen percent chance with the rockets. We'll hold off on the rockets this turn. Let's just do this. Engaging target. Get some good damage on these vehicles and hopefully get rid of them. I got lots of armor left. A lot of turret damage though. One good missile salvo might be able to take it out. Looks like they may have fixed the spawning problem over here. That's nice. Come on guys, what are you doing? Decide what you're doing. We gotta kill this guy right here next turn, hopefully. Right here with all the rockets. I think he's in stomping range from the Kentaro. Okay, who's going next? Come on. Phase 18. Alright, GV. Um, this guy's going on 18 too, huh? We're only going to get one shot at it. Um, okay, well. Let's take that shot. Here it comes. Nope. Okay, damn it. Somehow we hit the other side, but whatever. Whatever. Maybe he'll back off. Unlikely, but he might. Can only hope. Oh. Gave up. Flames on the way. That just suits me fine. Puts me right into range of the Yenlo Wang next turn. And keeps me nice and toasty. Beautiful. Wish I had known that guy wasn't going to move. Enjoy the heat, buddy. You're going to need it next turn. You survived the AC-20. Okay, 17... I don't know what those guys go on. Could be this guy next. They may not be moving because they may be afraid of the fire. They may look at the fire as being like not the ideal thing to move through, so they don't move at all. That is possible.
Okay, gonna shoot on this guy. And firing. Nope. It's alright. That opens him up for a strike from me next turn. Yeah, little Wang's going on 14, huh? Okay, large laser. Come on. Send me a real Don't. Attempt. Fate. Okay, awestruck. I think he's got large laser in each arm, if I'm not mistaken. Oz Scout, I think, has two medium lasers in the center torso. What can I, do for you? I can't remember. It's been so long. Let's move into here. Rack is jammed. Yeah, well. 47 on this guy. It's not bad. Let's fire on him. Uh -huh. Eh. At least we got some fire over there, though. Okay, unjammed. Nice. Okay, it's moving to here. We're going to save our um, rockets. But I am going to switch these guys to dead fire. And we're going to try and chew this guy up. Here it comes. Wow, I missed with the big one. Really? Missing good percentage shots. Don't know what it is about my commanders past few seasons, or past few um, series, commanders haven't been all that great. Hopefully it changes the next series. We'll see how that goes. Did the yellow wang go already? No, he couldn't have gone already. I guess he did. He didn't even shoot or anything. Well, hopefully the next series with Osmium, the enemies are doing that. I'm going to start the next series. Well, I'll do a whole... The first episode will be all the settings and everything, just so you can see what I'm playing at. I'm here. Then depending on how it goes, we'll crank it up or down or whatever. Not that worried about it. But at least it'll give us a good idea what we're we'll be up against when we play the uh, the main campaign, and then um, we'll be able to start right at our a good level. Nice. But I want to switch the level up or down too, based on the scenarios that we're actually playing in. Oh, that's nice. Still not enough. Okay, we're going to rotate this way now. Should be able to finish him up this turn. I think the Kentaro can clean up this side. Once we take the arm off the Enlo Wang, I think he's got the AC on the left side, though. Is it the left or the right? I can't remember. We're going to zoom in on him here in a second. I want to see what side that's on. Goes on 16. He might go before us. Okay, does he have that? I thought the Yenlo Wang had it on the uh, other arm. No, it's on this this arm. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and hopefully take his arm off. Here it comes. Nope, we take the leg though. Ooh, we get to see it this time. Nice, burn him. TSM's off. Still doesn't matter though. That guy's going to be committed to the grave. Okay, there's the Warhammer. I want to zoom in on this guy too because I don't know if it's like the... Wow, man, that's two solid hits. Major armor loss. Yeah. He hit pretty well. I want to see this guy. Because the original Warhammer had like 
socketed arms, I guess. Yeah, it's not the same. It's not the same look. Like the before the PPCs just kind of went like right along. So the arm came down and attached to these long barrels. This I think is a little more realistic. It looks like it's it, you can pivot it up and down and it's a little better, but still not quite the same as it used to be, but whatever. Whatever. He's nice and overheated. That's a good chance to hit this guy. Let's leave the rack winded up. Wound wound up and fire. Wow, really that bad. Uh -huh. God, I'm loving the loadout on this Risk Irby. I wish we had this to start. At 30 tons, that's that's pretty damn good, I got to say. Yeah, nothing to see, huh? So the Enlo Wang still has got its AC-20. Although I don't think he's going to hit anybody once he gets up. Of course, you know, famous last words. But let's do this. And go ahead and do a multi-target. This will go on B. That'll go on B and we'll fire. Engaging multiple targets. Oh. So it's got an AMS Mark II. That's what it's got. Trying to protect that leg. Alright, we're just going to attack this guy, the Yen Lo Wang again. I think what we'll do is maneuver to his other side again. I'm not so worried about the large laser. If we take a back hit with the large laser, it's not going to kill us. It's not going to kill us. And this thing doesn't have very many hit points, so we're going to step on that the turn after. Can't believe this thing's still alive, though. I mean, that's not a I mean, that's a fair amount of hit points, though. 576 or whatever it was. Damage is minor, Commander. Still overheating, is he? Gonna go this route. Location confirmed. See if we get the arm. Copy yep, that. there it goes. 142 still. Panicking. This pod's taking damage now. Nice. So his main weapon's gone. I don't know what he's got as I thought he had like a chainsaw or something as a secondary weapon. Fuck, I hate that thing. You destroyed two of my rocket twenties. What do you need? Okay, let's get into here. And that guy's overheated, and we got range with those, but I think I want to switch to this. I'm gonna turn one of these off, and we're gonna fire at the warhammer here. Keep them nice and toasty. Plus 14 heat. Not much. We'll have to get in closer with the uh, SRMs. Use the Infernos from the SRMs on them. But if we get an open component with that Hydra, it'll be nice. But like I said, I still... I don't know. I still find it as cheat ammo. I think maybe I'll stop using it until the enemy um, starts using it on me. Once they start using it on me, then I'll go ahead and uh, start using it on them. I don't know. We'll figure it out in the next series. 
Ooh, those are good chances to hit. Let's just fire on the chameleon here. He's got a lot of energy weapons. Alright, hammer him. Wow. Lots of AMS. I'm gonna squatch this ferret. Okay, he's going to fire a maneuver. Good chances to hit on this guy. We're going to go full rock. Nice. Got the torso. That's that's the important part. That's the important part. Keep moving up because I want to stay on their flank here if I can. Don't want to let them get across this river. Forty-three percent chance to step on this guy. Wait a minute. He took out my whole left torso? How do both my rockets go down? Because they're not... Are they both... They're not both... Yeah, they are both in the same torso. It was probably a rocket ammo explosion. Son of a bitch. Well, let's hope we get him. Okay, gonna keep our right side to everybody over here on the right. What does he have on him? He's got a supercharger? Sure, buddy. Keep that supercharger. Wonder if we got range to step on this guy, the Kentaro. That guy, the Yenlo Wang doesn't have much left. Oh, you know what that, uh, that was the chainsaw going off. That's what it was. That's what it was. That's what the chainsaw sounds like, I think. What's up, huh? We do have range. Because fuck this guy. Let's take him out. I'm tired of this guy. AMS this, you motherfucker. Pardon my French, but it had to be said. You got that right! Yeah, you move into that fire. <laughs> fire that machine gun. You're really helping your team out there, buddy. Oh, you shut down. Yep. Well, isn't that interesting? Get into here. Copy that. Gonna do a. Do I just fire on this guy? Let's go for a headshot and let's switch these guys to. Uh, doesn't really matter, SRMs or LRMs. Let's just go with dead fire and see if we can plink his head off. Alright, firing. All right, tag is back up. Got it, Commander. Drop everything on this guy, please. See if we can get a headshot on him. On. Critical hit, Commander. If anybody should have backed off and just braced, it was that guy. can't fault him if he backed off and braced. There's no way. Yeah, we're okay here. 
I was just worried because it was the urban mech, but yeah, the back's it's fine. Let's just go for the kill. I'm gonna turn the wrist down to three. There it is. Okay, the big guy's gone. Let's clean it up. Let's just clean this up. So we didn't lose really that much off of this guy. I mean, it's tag barrage is gone, but we've got it. We've got one back at the house still. Although it says it's not. Oh, you know what? It's um right. It's in the arm with the X pulse. It was just turned off. Let's do this. Um, we lost some heat sinking abilities here. That and that. Uh, this can go on B. Good chance to hit. And turn this off. Wow. Yeah, the X pulse is the one way to go. It's the nice big heavy one. So let's go this route. Nice hit. Beautiful. Alright guys, let's just clean this up and go home. Getting tired of these guys. And the Wang fell. We're going to move forward with uh, Duskraker next turn and just shoot the Yen, the Yen Lo Wang. We're going to move up this way. I'm going to engage, him. I'm going to engage the uh, Kentaro on this chameleon here, fresh chameleon. But we'll target him this turn, hopefully kill him with the uh, lasers, and then we'll attack this guy with full TSMs next turn. That's the goal. See how that goes. This guy's missing his side. The guy's moving up right now. He's going to die because the side that he's missing is facing all our other guys here. Yeah. Um, Let's switch these around. I'm gonna go this route. I'm gonna keep this guy nice and toasty. Burn you fucker. And we'll just back up over to here. Back it up. Beautiful. How's it going? Okay, buddy. Um uh, Okay, get into here. Let's move. Don't think we're going to get our full heat up on this one. There's the kill. Nice. One last target. Got a bit of heat on him anyway. This guy's still shut down? He sure is. Let's try for the headshot. Um... Uh, Let's go to four so we don't jam. Actually, you know what? We're all right. Let's go to six. See if we can get a headshot in there. Here it comes. This guy's still heat efficient, too. It's great. Goes the right arm. Head hit. Beautiful. Yeah, I might as well just walk into the water here. A little bit cooled off. Nice. We're going to get GV on these guys over here. Gonna try and shred this guy up here. He's, he's wide open. We should be able to blow him apart this turn. Now, I think he's got AMS. Maybe. But we'll find out here in a second. Find out in a second. Just close the gap a bit. Get those MM, get those uh, MRMs in a good range. Yeah, beautiful. Here it comes. Nice. The AC finally hit. Sure has. It doesn't have evasive either. Um, yeah, it's a little hot, eh? Let's just go the LRM-15 with dead fire. Here it comes. We're on his side, so that should do it. Yeah. Um, 
Let's just stay here. I think we're okay. Need something, Chief? Don't quite have the range on that guy, eh? This will help with our heat. Jump into here. Yeah, because we got this, we can remove our instability. We can shoot this guy. Um, let's leave the fire fists off. And we'll fire the rest. Nice. Beautiful. Yeah, you don't need to. Just finish them off. Same thing. Here it comes. Okay, get back in the trees here. Moving to position. That guy's going to be back up in a second. Commander. See if we can clean this up. That's a back shot. I don't think it'll be enough though. Move order received. Don't think it'll be enough. Let's just get the AMS over here. Target this guy. Beautiful. Here it comes. Oh, it was enough. What do you know? All right, let's finish it up, girl. Oh, you got to move. Let's get in the water. We can probably use everything then. Just go for a CT shot. Switch into standard. Here it comes. That'll do it. There you go. That one's gone. You got that right. Mission successful. All right, there it is, folks. 230,000. That should more than cover any repairs. Although this is going to take a little while to fix. Not so bad, though. Um, going to take that to sell. We're going to need some sea bills. I don't think there's anything here that we really want. Machine gun array now. PPCs now. Snub nose PPC. How much does that weigh? Six. It's only 35 heat though. Hmm. I was thinking about replacing that on the um, on the Kentaro, but I don't think that's going to be and that's not going to be any better. It's just going to add weight with for less heat. Um, fire control system AC. It's a nice fire control system. Going to take that. I don't think it's better than what we have in the. Uh, urban mech but it might be it might just be fucked up coding all right uh what else is worth a lot chameleon parts ostrock part in the wang probably probably the most expensive maybe don't know we'll take that let's go all right we got a uh, ostrock part um, and a bunch of other stuff. All right. All right, let's see what we got here. Ooh, yeah. Well, at least we cover our, uh, covered our costs here. 15 days. It's not too bad. Well, two, wait, two days for the gauntlet? Really? Oh, right, yeah. It's a Talos I was thinking of. That's fine. Ten days for the towels. We'll get that fixed. So I'm going to jump systems. Going to look for a two and a half, three skull planet. When we, when we do the last episode, which will be the next episode, that will be probably a three skull mission against the clans. Just to see how we do. If it ends up being crappy, if I record it and ends up being crappy, I'll go again uh, and won't show you that particular episode. I'll just go with a really good episode. Uh, so hopefully it's a, we go out on a bang. But uh, I'm going to leave this episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.